Well, thanks so much for joining us for tonight's 10 at 10. I'm Tim Blotz. Our top story is police have identified the man whose body was found dismembered in northeast Minneapolis. Our Mary McGuire joins us now live with the details. And Mary, this is all new information within the past couple of hours. That's right, Tim. We just got an update from police uh, just about uh, an hour and a half ago, and they say that the events leading up to Johnson's death, they are still unclear, but they do believe that his murder was recent. They haven't recovered all of his body parts, and that's why they're still asking for anyone with information to come forward. Now, authorities have identified the human body parts that were found on Thursday morning as belonging to 36-year-old Adam Richard Johnson of Minneapolis. It was a gruesome scene in northeast Minneapolis as several of his body parts were discovered near the 300 block of Main Street. A short time later, more body parts were found nearby on 3rd Avenue Northeast and University Avenue. Now, typically the identity of crime victims comes from the county medical examiner's office, but Minneapolis police got special permission to do so given the nature of this case. They say they didn't locate any missing persons reports on Johnson and that his family was notified of his death earlier today. The family has been notified of this death, uh, which is why we're doing this so late this evening. Um, we had the information this afternoon. It took us some time to get everybody notified. Uh, and obviously our condolences go out to that family. We will work diligently as we do on every case to try to bring the person who did this to justice. Now, investigators say that there's no reason to believe that there is more than one victim in this case. A cause of death outside of the obvious trauma to Johnson's body hasn't been determined just yet. Reporting live in Minneapolis, Mary McGuire, Fox 9. All right, Mary.